my friend actually called me last night and said he found a baby possum living under his shed. Oh, and he jumped back up. He's jumping back up so you can see his tail right there. I see his face. Yeah. He's gonna run this way, Hannah. I'm so, I'm not ready for that. What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all are having an amazing day. So guys, we have one crazy heck of a day ahead of us. Now, my friend actually called me last night and said he found a baby possum living under his shed. So of course, we hopped into action, we jumped to it, and we rescued this little baby. But before we hop into today's crazy rescue video with this little possum, we're actually gonna be heading inside and checking on Mocha, my female ragdoll's new newborn kittens. So let's go. Hi, mama. We are here to look at these little babies. So guys, you can see that these babies are nursing right now. Mama wants us to say hello. Hi, Mama, yes. You get all the pets and you get all the love. But guys, take a look at these babies. These babies are growing so strong every single day, nursing good and gaining good weight, which is very, very essential for growing newborn kittens. Now we've been monitoring them multiple times a day to make sure she's doing an amazing job as a mama kitty and these babies couldn't be healthier. Now guys, I know you all have been wondering what we're gonna name these little babies and I still haven't picked a name for them. So what I want you to do right now is comment down below a name for Mocha's little babies right here. We have five beautiful newborn babies right here and just look at these little guys. So tiny, so little, and mommy, you, you can't sit on them. You gotta nurse the babies. Guys, another day, another crazy mission. So I'm literally hanging out at my house and I got a call. I got a call from my friend Delano. You guys all know Delano. And he told me he found a baby possum. Now, it is coming to spring season. The babies are coming around, the little squirrels, the little possums. And he called me and said his dog was barking. And he looked under his shed, his little barn he has. And he saw a baby possum. Now, he sent me this picture, guys. I don't know if you can see it, but that's its little fur right there. It's actually a live video, so let's see. Guys, yeah, look at it. That little possum right there curled up in a little ball. Now this possum looks very, very tiny. Definitely got separated from the mom. Definitely lost. So we're going to head to his house and rescue this little baby. Alright guys, so we made it to my friend's house. Now it got very, very dark on the car ride over. So bear with me. We do have a flashlight. My friend has a flashlight. He said he's in his backyard. So we're going to go on ahead. Open up his gate. Alright guys, make sure it's shut. All right, bear with me. I know it's very, very dark. Delano? <laughs> what? Come quick. Oh my gosh, guys. He says he's still there. Now, it took us quite some time to get here. It was like, oh my gosh, Delano, I didn't even see you. So Delano's right here. Okay, where's the flashlight? Here. Okay, so here's Delano. Hi, guys. So Delano's here. Where? Where is it? It's down here underneath the barn. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh. How did you spot this? Well, my dog, he was barking, and I was doing work inside the barn, and I was like, oh what is he goodness. barking at? Oh, I... Where the heck? I don't even see him. Is he on the right side? Hold on. He should be, like, straight ahead underneath behind that bush kind of thing. Okay guys, we're looking, but I think we're gonna, we're gonna have to put the camera down for a second and, and we're gonna have to get a better look. Guys, we have located the possum. I don't know if you can see, but that right there is his tail hanging off the beam right there. So Delano is gonna do the honors. I, he has longer arms than I have. So he's sticking his hands in no, there. No, no, he's moving. Oh, he's moving. I don't know if I can even reach that far. Okay, oh, okay, I'm gonna check on this side. All right, guys. All right, no, I don't see anything on this side. We need to try to get him somehow this way. I don't know what we're gonna do. We still see his tail, he's hanging out right there. Oh my gosh, guys. All right, guys, the possum fell down. I don't know if you guys can see the possum right here, but he's literally hanging out right there. You see him, Delano? Oh my goodness, he's so small. Yeah, he's really, really tiny. How old do you think he is? Yeah! Uh, definitely, probably about like a month or two months old. He you has see, to be. He seems to be a little bit scared of Coco. Yeah. Oh my, my gosh, dog. guys, you can see him a lot better. But the reason we got his dog out here is to be able to locate him because we couldn't find him. But now that we located him, he's a lot safer because we can relocate him. Oh, and he jumped back up. He's jumping back up so you can see his tail right there. So somehow we need to coax him out. All right, guys, so we got a stick. Now this is actually to pick up trash. Now I'm thinking we're going to be able to grab this little possum. So guys, bear with me. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see the entire rescue fine. yeah that's perfect we're gonna oh your dog's back under there and 
Let's go on ahead. Let's see. Oh, I got it. Oh. Darn it, it went away. Oh, oh I see, see him over here. I see his body. Look. Oh, oh, okay. We see his body over here. So maybe we should take a net. Wait, it's not even, it's not, um. It's not a. It's not what I'm talking about the camera. Okay, wait, look. The famous. Okay. Let me see. Let me see if we can stick the net under. Net over instead. Okay, You're... look, you can kind of see it's a butt from here. Let's try to get it. Maybe. Okay, you want to try and grab it again with the tail? Here, why don't you push this over here? Just leave the camera there. It needs okay. light. It needs light, but I can try and grab it. All right, so we're going to push it from this side. We're going to need to do okay. that soon. No, you just, we're going to try to push it from there. I we're can't gonna angle. see. I'll push it from there, and I'm going to try to catch it from over here. Okay, go. Oh, and I got its tail. You do? I got its tail. Look, come on the side. Baby. Move the camera so you can see. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Delano got its tail right here. Oh, oh, oh no. no. Okay. Wait, maybe you should try to push no. it over. I definitely could catch it over here. Try to push it. Try to push it this way. Oh, oh, okay. You see him? I saw its tail for a second. Okay. Oh, oh, keep going, keep going. I could definitely try to grab him. I'm trying to grab him right now. All right, guys, rescue in progress. Yeah. We're trying to get this possum. All right, can you keep trying to push him? I don't know if you guys can see him really pretty well. Can you see him? Yeah, I can see him. I can see his like tail over here. Come on, move. You see him there? No, I don't. I don't, okay. I don't see any part of him. Ah! Okay, so Delano has a net on this side, ah! guys. And we're gonna try to poke him from this side. See? Oh wait, I see him a lot more. Wait, wait, wait. The camera is not on that side. It's okay, it's okay. Do you see him now? No, I only see him. <gasps> oh, there he is, there he is. <laughs> Guys, you can see this little, the little possum finally got knocked down. Now we're gonna try to lure him this way. So, bear with me, guys. I see his face. Yeah. He's gonna run this way, Hannah. <laughs> I'm not ready for this. Hey, get, get him, get him with the glove, get him with the glove. Where's the glove, where's the glove? Guys, all right, and we got him. Wait, wait. Delano. Delano. Coco. Not yet. Not yet. Okay. Grab the camera. Uh. Guys. That was absolutely... Okay, wait. Start from the beginning. It's Your hair is like really it, messed it up. It doesn't matter. Guys. That was absolutely the craziest rescue that I have ever been through my entire life. But thankfully, we got this little guy. He doesn't seem like he's injured at all, but he's definitely very, very scared. Now, you can see, even though this is his natural habitat, this is not a safe place for him. We're going to actually be contacting a wildlife rehabber down here in South Florida because native species like this, you cannot rehabilitate. Now, we're going to call the wildlife rehabber, see what the next plan of action is, and see if they think that this guy needs to be rehabilitated because he's too young or if we should just re-release him to a safer environment. So, guys, let's go ahead, call the wildlife rehabber. So guys, we're just waiting to hear back from the wildlife rehabber. They haven't answered just yet, but guys, take a look right here. It's really, really cool. Just like monkeys, possums actually have a prehensile tail as well. He's not doing it right now. He's trying to play dead so we don't hurt him, but buddy, you're safe now. But this guy has a prehensile tail that he can actually put his body weight on, which is really, really cool. Another amazing fact about possums is they don't carry rabies. Now, they're really good insect eaters. They also eat other small rodents and will keep the population of rats and insects down. But at Delano's house, he has a lot of chickens. And once this little guy gets a little bit older, he could go after and attack the chickens. So that's why he called me to the rescue. We saved this little guy, not only from the dogs, but also from his chickens getting attacked. So what we're gonna do right now, because this guy is very, very scared, is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put him in this bucket right here. And three, two, one, there you go. Little, little buddy, you're safe now. You don't, you don't have to pretend to be dead. So what possums do when they get threatened, when they feel scared, is they will actually pretend like they're dead. So that's exactly what he's doing right here, guys. If you take a better look, he's acting like he is out cold, that he is not alive, but you can see he's breathing perfectly fine. And guys, we have heard back from the rehabber. So I asked the rehabber, and you guys are seeing it with your very own eyes, if he's too old to be rehabilitated or if I could re-release him back into a safer location. And she said that he is the perfect 
decides to be re-released, this little guy is going to be fending for himself, not this age. These guys are going to be fending and foraging for food on their own. Now, even though he looks very, very tiny, this little guy is mighty and powerful, even though he's still acting like he is dead. So what we are gonna do is we are going to be heading to a safer location to re-release this possum. So guys, we have made it to a very wooded forest, a very protected area for this little guy to grow up and live his possum life. Now you can see he's looking a lot better. You can see he's moving around now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab him like this. All right, guys, so you can see he's trying to bite. I know, little buddy, you're gonna be safe very, very soon. So we're gonna scruff him like this. And you can see I'm pretty sure that this little guy is a female. Now we don't want to mess with him too, too much, but we are just going to say a little goodbye. All right, can we give you a kiss and... Now guys, this is the ideal place to let this possum go to grow up because there's a lot of food, there's a lot of protection, and this guy is going to be very, very safe here. So we're going to say our goodbyes and we are going to let this guy go. We're going to put him right here. Can you guys see him? And come on, little buddy. All right, go. So we're going to, let's see. Let's get him. We're going to put him a little bit in more. All right, we're going to put him right here. You can see he's still very, very scared. Let's give him a second. And we're gonna go ahead, tickle his little tail right here, and you can see he is just trying to protect himself right here. So we're gonna let this little guy go right here. But guys, that is going to end today's video. If you all enjoyed today's possum rescue video, give this video a big thumbs up. Now guys, comment down below a little prayer that this guy is happy and healthy and he survives in this new home. Now guys, if you wanna see some crazy rescued animal videos, well, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel in the link down below.